Hi friend, I hope in this tutorial you have been having some fun and having some understanding of the operating system and the windows that we are talking about. Okay now, now we talk about the how they look at this last time, uh, the, the last the previous tutorial. Now I want to show you some things on your windows that you don't really need to be asking for no no i don't have this um place can i someone can send it to me another thing now um, your windows down here you can see we have this is what they call paint text paint tech that's um you can paint your you can paint your icons to this place you can pin your icon icons to this place now to make it for a fast a fast use for a fast use maybe you don't want to be finding your icons or anything it's also okay them like okay for instance now maybe uh mozilla now is in this place so i want to pin it here for instance or maybe this might be, okay let me use a vlc media to pin it here then you right click on it and when you right click on it then you click on paint to start so when you paint to start you paint to start you see we have it here now it's paint to start that means you will be labeled the, the LCD now is labeled together with it so that means I can click here to start using my LC LC media player I can click here to start using it okay let me paint my not paints IDE uh, paint to start paint to start to start now that is all about designing you can design your icon maybe you want to reposition the icon to make it for a start use that is one of the ways okay now let's go now this is window 8 so by window 7 you have your start menu in this place where you can click and when you click on it menu will pop up and they select well, this window 8 and window 8 I when I'm looking for anything I click on search the search simply stands for searching for a document maybe I'm searching for a video on my um, compora I type the word video and I click on search that's the difference between the um, windows 8 and windows 7 or window XP but as a beginner, I would advise you guys to go for Windows 7 you know, to, for you to make more easier for you to understand than um, using Windows 8. But Windows 8 is also a good um, and a good operating system. Okay, now here we have the links. This is the battery. Now this is the stop the battery. This is the battery. Then this is the internet. When you connect to an internet, this is just like a server on your phone, like on your phone when you on your phone and you click on connect to internet, you see an HP or you know, an E Ethernet sign symbol come up on your phone. There's it here. There's that there's a system and now I have no connection. It said no connection and available. And that's why you're seeing the internet. We have the link here, we have the speaker. Now we have uh, some application that is also tied to this link. So all these things are windows. They are all windows. They are all the items inside the window. So understanding your windows will simply give you confidence to operate your system. Then we have the time here to change your time. You double click on it. You click on it and you click on change time, and you change your time to the exactly time that you want to change it to. Um, I know this tutorial has make a difference for you in operating your windows and I know you have have a compatible knowledge just for understanding of the windows so now you talk about the windows you talk about the icons you talk about the menus you talk about everything now I want to show you some secret some it has some items on the windows again which are inside the windows in the next tutorial I will show you that thank you